If you're interested in seeing what I do with this wall art that I got from Dollar Tree last year, stay tuned. My channel, this is Miss V. Um, using items I already have to recreate something different. You know, that's what my channel is about. So y'all remember last year when everybody was hauling these um, mirror decor frames. This one says love and I have the other one that says live and laugh. What I'm going to do is take the mirror out of this and use it to create some wall art. This is a perfume bottle that you hang on the wall. And what you're gonna need is, since I couldn't find any square, any more square frames, I decided to take the frames out of this. Good idea, right? So I took the frame out, and I still can use the um, decorations. I mean, I still can use the, I just put a piece of white paper behind it. I actually like it better with the white paper than the mirror. So I got my live and I got my laugh. I've used those two mirrors already. So I'm going to take this mirror out. It has some screws on the back. I've already taken the screws out. So I just take the um, mirror out. And I'm going to create this cute little um, perfume bottle. This can be used as wall decor. So that's what I'm going to be doing. So stay tuned. Okay, before I get started, let me tell you. You're going to need a mirror, of course. Then you're going to need the smaller mirror. You did find that at the Dollar Tree. And some diamond wrap and some glue. And some more of these blocks. So stay tuned. So I'm taking my mirror out. And I don't clean the mirror until after I finish making the perfume bottle. So here's the mirror, so what I'm going to do is I'm go ahead and know what I'm going to do is embellish this with some diamond wrap and embellish the sides of this also with the diamond wrap. And I'll be back. Okay, I've embellished the small mirror with one row of the diamond wrap. And before I put the diamond wrap on the larger mirror, I forgot to tell you, I added the blocks. I spray painted them a light silver color just so the um, wood tone won't show through as much. But I ran out of paint. But that's not that important because this is a wall decor. So you won't see it. You won't see the sides anyway. So that's what I've added here. I have a total of 4, 8, 14. And I put it, I um, screwed them up on this side just so you have some dimension on the side. Of the side of the um, perfume bottle. So what I'm going to do now is add the backing, which is a piece of foam board from the Dollar Tree. Just going to go ahead and cut that down the sides and add that. Just so you can have a clean finish. Back to it. Okay, I got my diamond wrap added to my larger mirror. And what I have done is put the entire three row on there, but I only glued down the first row. That way, I'm going to glue this down. The other two rows down. And then I'll add some more diamond wrap right there. That way, you can have that. Seamless. Look, it looks seamless. So now I've used my Duro glue to glue it directly to the mirror. I can use my hot glue to glue it to the wood because it it adheres pretty good. So I'll do a couple of rolls of that, show you how I do that. Super stick because it's hot. And I just do that all the way around. I'll 
gonna keep doing that and I'll come back. Okay, this is what I have. diamond wrap so we can cover the rest of these blocks and this uh, foam board. Okay, I got this one all embellished the way around. And now I'm getting ready to add a small mirror. And I got the other one right beside it so I can kind of eyeball it so they will be kind of easy. together vertically then two of them horizontal which you need this little and put some diamond wraps around around it and attach it also and so this is it this is um my perfume bottle wall decor so stay tuned for the end so you can 